We're hanging out at the beach today and doing a little bit of work and I'm going to do oil change on my truck. And the reason why I do oil change is because I've been quoted through the drive through oil change 150 to 225 because the truck uses a lot of oil and I'd rather just do it myself. So here's the filter and before anything I want to make sure that the filter is the right one because I'd hate to be stuck in this beach parking lot trying to find the right filter. <laughs> Here it is. So we'll take it under there and compare it. So we got the bucket in position, and all we do is turn the tap down. Boom! And all that nasty oil is running into the bucket. And I know that I'll be safe because the oil is not more than five gallons. Now that the oil's finished dripping, I'm gonna close the tap. The old oil in there. So instead of um, instead of unscrewing the oil filter, I'm actually going to hit it with a hammer and a and a punch because that way the oil the oil will run from here into the bucket and I can empty the filter before I can unscrew. So that it actually flows into the bucket. Boom. First thing you do with a new oil filter, you just grab some of the old oil on your finger and you just lube up the, the gasket right here so it makes a nice seal. There we go. And then once the seal's all lubed up, we just spin it on righty tighty. Not too tight, just tighten, hand tightened. There we go. Okay, so that's everything I need to do under the truck. Now that I've filled up a lot of the oil, I'm going to check the dipstick. 